Welcome to evening prayer, my friends, on this Thursday evening here at St. John's. Our text this week is Psalm 139, the psalm that is appointed for this coming Sunday. It's an incredibly personal psalm. The writer gives thanks that God knows him or her so well, gives thanks that there is no place that the writer can go where God is not, gives thanks that God has knit him or her together in their mother's womb. But the tone of the psalm changes towards the end, and there's a passage in it that we rarely read or sing in worship because it's violent. But it acknowledges the presence of evil in this world and this psalmist's reaction Listen to these few verses, starting at 19. Oh, that you would kill the wicked, O God, and that the bloodthirsty would depart from me, those who speak of you maliciously and lift themselves up against you for evil. Do I not hate those who hate you, O Lord? And do I not loathe those who rise up against you? I hate them with perfect hatred. I count them my enemies. As one of my teachers says, we don't excuse these verses, but we can understand them. They arise from some situation of both the psalmist and God being either lied about or spoken against strongly. And this is the psalmist's response. But note that the psalmist calls on God in this struggle and leaves the judgment to God. At the end of the day, we leave the judging to God. I invite you into prayer. Calm us, O Lord, this evening as you stilled the storm Still us, O Lord, this evening, and keep us from harm. Let all the tumult within us cease, and enfold us, Lord, in your peace. Bless the work that is done, and the work that is to be. Bless the servants that we are, and the servants that we will be. Be near to us this night, we pray, through the spirit of love. Amen. And this Celtic benediction, the peace of God be over you to shelter you, under you to uphold you, about you to protect you, behind you to direct you ever with you to save you. The peace of all peace be yours this night in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Thank you for praying with me tonight. I pray you rest well. Good night.